Ethiopia has just inaugurated the Grand Ethiopian Renaissance Dam, a $5 billion mega project and now Africa's largest hydroelectric power facility. The dam stands 145 meters tall, stretches more than a mile, and contains a reservoir as large as Greater London, generating 5,150 megawatts of electricity. This immense structure places Ethiopia among the top 20 hydroelectric dam operators globally and marks a momentous step towards modernization, with millions set to gain access to electricity. Prime Minister Abiy Ahmed views the dam as a turning point, highlighting new access to power and plans to export surplus electricity to neighboring countries. The government insists the dam will expand energy, regulate water flow, and limit floods, making it both an economic engine and a symbol of national pride after 14 years of construction. However, Egypt and Sudan, heavily dependent on the Nile, fear the dam could reduce crucial river flows, threatening water security and agriculture downstream. With negotiations deadlocked and accusations of unilateral action, the project has become a tense geopolitical flashpoint. But independent researchers say no major disruptions have occurred so far. Ultimately, the fate of the dam hinges on whether Ethiopia, Egypt, and Sudan can cooperate and compromise, choosing regional benefit over conflict.